Hi, this is JC. Um, I haven't done a video on here in a long time. Uh, just not a lot of excuses, except I have been sick, and there's been a lot going on, but hopefully I'm back. Today I'm going to share with you how I plan daily. Um, I'm just going to start off here and kind of show you what I use, and then I'll get into um, how I use them. So I found this planner at Hobby Lobby. Hey, let me straighten up a little bit. I'm sitting crooked. I found this planner at Hobby Lobby and I fell in love with it. Um, it I believe it's by Paper House. I'm not 100% sure because it didn't have anything on it to indicate and I can't even find anything in the planner to tell me who made it. So if you know, leave a comment below because I'm really curious. I think it's Paper House. I never heard of them before. I'm pretty sure, I know it's not a happy planner. Um, it could be uh, a recollections, but I don't think so. I've tried, I've looked all over the internet to try to find it, and I can't find it. So if you know, please tell me. Um, as you can see, I got this. It was on clearance. It was normally $29.99 for $17.99. And I think it is just so cute. It just says, let's do this. And this is a 2017 to 18 planner. It is an 18-month planner. Um, it comes with some stickers in the front, which is very unusual. It comes a couple of pages of those. Here, let me show you. They're really cute. Here's some more here. And then um, I really like the dividers. Uh, they're beautiful dividers. Let's look at October. And it changes color. Isn't this beautiful? The best is yet to come. It's just a beautiful planner. And I like the way it's set up with the other page. Uh, currently, this month's goals, birthdays, important dates, and then it has a calendar up top. I just think it's beautiful. I love the way it's, it's laid out. There's little flowers on every page. Um, I'll show you this week. I have not decorated this week yet. Um, that's something I'm fixing to do in a little bit. But it has a little flower down here in the corner, and it's laid out much like a happy planner. Um, I love the font. I think the font is so pretty, and the colors. And, um, yeah, so I just, I really love it. Now, I'm going to talk about these in a little bit. I'm going to give you a better view, how I use them to plan. This is mainly my personal planner. In other words, these are things that I do like exercise and um, birthdays and things like that, just regular personal planner stuff. This is my business planner. This I use more day-to-day -day things that I need to get done. This is based on the day designer. However, this right here, this is my own cover. I created that. And then, again, the back is the same pattern. And then, oh, it really was shiny, wasn't it? Can you see it? Okay, there we go. That's I created this cover. And then the pages, I changed up a little bit. Um, they're not exactly like a day designer. Let me get you a blank page. Let's see. So normally these boxes over here have different sayings in them. Um, I changed them to where it suited me. The rest of it is much the same. You have... Uh, a timed layout here, time of the day, and then you have like a to-do check-off list over there. hope you can see this. So I changed these because I, I needed them to where I could use them. So I did change that saying. And I printed these out myself and created this binder myself. Um, and I use it every day. So this is today, and I'm not even through with it. Um, I use the time if I know there's things I need to do or if I want to lay out my day. And this is my to-dos for today and some main things I need to get done. Some phone call I need to do. I don't have anything on do. I do need to pay some bills. I didn't put a follow-up. So, yeah, this is my, my work. This is what I do every single day. So, that's what I use this planner for. And then... This one, I, again, was in Hobby Lobby, and up towards the front, they had a bunch of planners. That's where I found um, the first one that I showed you, and then I found this one on another trip, and 
was, I don't know why I picked it up. I guess I was just curious to see what it was. And I have discovered a way to use this, and it's pretty cool. So this is actually a teacher's planner, as you can tell by the saying on the front. It's a full-size, big planner, and it is a happy planner. And here's the deal. Let's go to, it starts in October. Well, no, it doesn't. It started, I believe, in September. August or September, I can't remember. I moved uh, some of the front pages to the back because I can use this. I don't have to worry about it. It's not dated. And I decided, let me show you this week. Excuse me, my nose itches. Does that mean somebody's coming to see me? Um, this week yet is not very laid out, but I'll go ahead and show you. This, here, let me, I need to stretch it out. So this is this. This is this week. There are, it's a teacher's planner. There are seven places across the planner that you can put a subject, which is designed for subjects, and then the days of the week, Monday through Friday. Um, I cut Friday into Friday and Saturday. So what I'm using this for, it's very interesting. The first part, where there's three, three things, um, and you have the place over here that you can put the date. The first thing right here, I use for my various YouTube channels. So I have Genuine, The Creative Owl, and my personal channel, which I'm starting to do some videos for. So here I just plan out what kind of videos I want to do, what days I want to do them on, um, what days I need to get posted. So that's just kind of, and I'm still trying to develop uh, a system, so it's not 100%. Then over here on the other half, which has four boxes, I have Instagram, Facebook, Pinterest, and Twitter. This reminds me, because I usually have it, this is hard to do. I should be doing this different. But this right here reminds me that this video which is over here, which I've done a video for, and it's going to go up today. I need to, because it's today's video that's posting, I need to go over here and do social media for. So I need to be able to post to Instagram, Facebook, Pinterest, and Twitter about what I'm doing, about the tea haul. So that's the spread. I know this is kind of confusing, but I think this is really going to work and help keep me on track. So every day I have a different video that I need to work social media across. And then, um, yeah, so that's this. I'm still developing my system, but this is a great way to do it. Again, I got this one, again, was on clearance. I think it's another one that was $29.99 that I paid $17.99 for. And um, I've ordered a different cover from Etsy. So, yeah. So that's what I use this one for. So actually, I guess I don't need to do it. That's just how I do my, my planning in the morning. I sit down with a cup of tea and these three planners, and I stretch out my day, how I need to do things. So today I need to concentrate on getting some videos done like this one and on um, social media, of course which I do every day, and uh, actually this afternoon, I don't have that, yeah I do, this afternoon I have that in my day designer, uh, I need to make cookies for a get together tomorrow, so I'm going to leave it here, I think I've pretty much explained everything, um, it still may be a little confusing, so later this week I might sit down and do an overhead and kind of go over with you again how I use these, but, yeah, this is a weird system, um, and I tried to incorporate all these things into one planner, and it's just not possible for me, because YouTube videos are something I enjoy doing. I haven't been doing. Um, I have done the last couple of days, but I need to get back on track, and this, I think, will help me do that. So, 
if you're confused, don't feel bad. Um, but this is what works for me. But I just want to kind of introduce it to you and let you know what's going on. So, <laughs> if you find it interesting, be sure and subscribe. As always, hit that little bell if you want to know when another video is going up. Um, feel free to comment and give it a like. And I will talk to you later. Take care. Bye for now. Ooh, that confused me, I think. <laughs> Let me get some tea. Oh. Mm. Hmm.